Mass Shorts. Equivalent expressions with the distributive property. The distributive property can help us generate equivalent expressions like these. Check out how all of these expressions are equal to 20. Lucy bakes cookies for five of her friends, five lemon and 15 chocolate, for a total of 20 cookies. This mathematical equation represents the cookies. Lucy makes five groups of one lemon and three chocolate cookies and distributes them equally among her five friends. This expression shows the arrangement of cookies. But Carl's the only one that likes lemon, and Stacy doesn't eat sweets. So Lucy redistributes the cookies into one group of five lemon and three groups of five chocolate. Mathematically, the new arrangement looks like this, or this. No matter how the cookies are arranged, Lucy has the same number of cookies, and the expressions are equivalent. Here's how the distributive property helps generate equivalent expressions. The 5 in this expression is distributed to the 1 and the 3, creating another expression. Look familiar? Multiply the numbers, and you get a third equivalent expression. To create yet another expression, rewrite the 5 plus 15, so that each term has a 5. To reverse the process, pull the 5 from this expression, and here's another equivalent expression. The distributive property works with algebra too. Here we have 3 times x. We don't know what x is, but we know that there are three groups of them. Let's add 6 of something else, represented as three groups of 2. The arrangement can be expressed like this, or like this. All three of these expressions are equivalent. The distributive property is one way to create equivalent expressions.